Hello guys and happy Vlogmas 2. I can't believe I'm already saying about Vlogmas 2. I am so excited and really enjoyed starting vlogging again so I hope you enjoyed that video. Excuse for the mountain on my chin. I'm actually quite proud of how I've covered it. I did concealer, powder, foundation, powder, concealer, powder. So hopefully this isn't gonna bud. Fingers crossed. I am off to go and see Chloe and India, which will be really lovely, so I will probably capture them in this vlog. We're going to do some shooting outside. Yeah, so we're going to be shooting outside. Apparently the weather has dropped, which is great. Uh, changing outfits in this weather isn't ideal. That's the beauty and the um the elegancy of our careers um but yeah so today we are shooting i'm doing this outfit first so i'm doing quite a normal casual outfit today i'm wearing my old navy zara coat a gorgeous wool and cashmere cardigan some boots my long boots and some H&M H&M jeans. So that is my outfit today. I've got done my hair, just nice and straight. Gutted though, because in my last vlog I told you that I've been styling my hair with the new Bondi Boost. Um, and I filmed a video which I needed to send to them and I've deleted it. So I'm going to have to come home super quick tonight and do that video because that's just an absolute nightmare. Um, but yeah, but other than that, it is a lovely sunny day. I'm all packed, ready to go, and it'll be nice to see the girls. So yeah, hope you enjoy Vlogmas 2. Shoot, shoot, shoot. Work it, girl. Oh, <laughs> I am with India and Chloe now, and we are just shooting some photos. I got a coffee because it's super cold. So guys, we are done. <laughs> I love how we've gone from your vlog like woohoo and now I'm like, oh, it's so cold. I'm like in the full on tracksuit and India's in party wear. <laughs> Show the sparkle bit. Shazam. <laughs> Shazam. Beautiful. <laughs> um, yeah, we've just finished. Clothes just gone. But yeah, I'm gonna head home now and yeah, I've got some deadlines. So I don't know how much I, I don't think I actually filmed that much. It was so cold. Yeah. My hands are like a numb. My hands just get too cold. Ooh. But yeah, I'll catch you guys when I'm home. Bye, Inns. Bye. Oh, it is so, so cold outside. I think I'm going to have to go and put the heating on. It is freezing, but it is a lot later now. It's three o'clock. Um, I've just came in, had some lunch. I've just got a cup of tea and a Misfits plant-based chocolate peanut butter bar. These are so good. Um, quite addictive and it feels quite naughty in a sense because I know it's healthy because it's plant-based and it's vegan and it's protein but you kind of feel like oh I'll just keep having them because you're like they're healthy but probably not um but very good and full of protein which I'm lacking at the moment because I have cut a um, meat out my diet properly now except fish and I don't eat fish that much so I really need to up my protein and I ran out of my protein powder but that's not what I came on here to chat to you about um I've actually got to film um another video tonight because I unaccidentally deleted my video which is okay just think about onwards and upwards um, and I'm just wearing I wanted to show you because I love this outfit this is a Chelsea Piers loungewear set like a really cute co-op it's got this like really nice cream color like really thick um, ribbons and yeah it's so soft and so comfortable I love it. So that was my last outfit I shot with the girls. So yeah, so not much else to update you on, but that's okay because I'm not doing daily vlogs. I'm doing like every other day. So hopefully tomorrow will be somewhat entertaining. And yeah, tomorrow actually I will go through the home stuff with you. That is what I'll do because I've got some really nice pieces and hopefully there'll be a little bit of a sale still on. But yeah, so I will catch you guys in a bit.
my makeup done for today that wasn't me that was my knee gliding <laughs> against the um unit um good morning guys i hope you're all well and having a lovely day so i am starting wait i have already started vlogmas too this is the second day of vlogmas too like i said i'm not putting any pressure on myself and what i get out is what i get out and yeah i'm just gonna try and enjoy it and shoot as much content as i can for you so i've just got ready i have a day at home i'm going to be doing some styling videos i'm also going to be sharing you what um home bits i have and i also am going to organize um my products and stuff upstairs so that will be really good so yes yeah, so i hope you're all well i am now going to go and blow dry my hair because i washed it again this morning and um, just needed a bit of a boost but yeah no i hope you're all well and i'll catch you guys in a bit So today's outfit is a very um, brave outfit because if you do know me, Millie Moo can get all kinds of sauce and dirt on her jumper. That sounded quite wrong. But I will be able to put food all over my jumper and coat. Um, and I don't know why, I'm such a clean person so I don't get where it comes from. But I'm always a mucky pup. Anyway, I'm wearing my white jumper from Fall From Reckless. Some black flares, ignore the slippers, although it goes with the outfit. <laughs> um, my fourth and reckless coat, which I'm obsessed with. I'll try and find a similar one down below. And my white Pelline bag, which I'm a huge fan of. Absolutely love it. It's quite a um it's quite low in price in comparison to other higher end brand bags on the market. I believe it was like 200 300 pounds Still expensive, but it's an investment and the quality is incredible. So I'm a huge fan of this. I'm just gonna put on my chunky Doc Martins. Um I've got a parcel to drop off back at the post office, and then I'm actually gonna go and get a patch test. I completely forgot that I had to go and do that for my brows tomorrow i'm getting my brows done by a lady called claire um my friend beth and india go to them and really recommend her so i'm really excited for that so yeah so that's what i'm going to do it now so just to get it over and done with and just get it out of the way and then i'll come back and style some outfits have lunch and a coffee and yeah that's how productive my day is going to be i really want to get my gift guide done i need to get my gift guide done so i'm going to go and do that after the styling videos we're gonna do it. It's gotta be done. Also, can we just appreciate how my hair okay. is looking at the moment? I feel like it's calmed down so much. At the kind of beginning of lockdown, my hair was just struggling so badly. And it's got so much better now, and I'm so happy it's got so thick. I've been using the Olaplex um, number three hair treatment once a week or once twice a week. Um, and it just really helps. And yeah, I can't believe I'm actually gonna go brown. I'm quite nervous. But I'm so excited. I feel I would just be a bit more natural. So, yeah, cannot wait to show you that. Right, so my other storage boxes have arrived, which is fab. So what I'm going to do is probably put you on a timer um, and kind of show you what I get up to. Basically, I just wanted these for under the bed. So I'm going to have, like, over here, that's a, like, decoration box. Bless my soul. Um, so I've got some like party stuff that can go in there, like these. I just keep these because I think they're just so cute. So for now at the moment I've just got this little box. Um, and I've just got like ribbons and cute things like that, dried flowers. So yeah, this is like a little bit of a decoration box like so um over here it's like scarves and cosmetic stuff so i might just keep it as a cosmetic stuff and maybe put my scarves with maybe jumpers or bags um, and like a blanket for instance so that would probably be, be a bit more suited for example having that in there and then all of those. so i'm going to bring my time lapse and i'll show you what i get to
Hello guys, I hope you're well. I am off to go and do a bit of food shopping and to get my brows done. I have been inspired to go to this lady called Claire. She is called Brow Perfector. I'm going to leave her down below if you're in the Brighton area. Um, my friend India, India Moon, and my nail lady, Beth, rave about her. So I'm very excited. I have left my brows. I haven't plucked them. I haven't done anything. So you are going to see a before and then an after. But I'm going to go food shopping first. It is chucking it outside chucking it and it is so cold i slept awfully last night i have an old house we live in a very old cottage but i have my slough my hot water bottle slough which is all good but i'm all wrapped up i've only got mascara on no makeup fresh makeup free day to day um yeah i'm gonna go and go to do some food shopping and then i'll catch you guys after when i've done my brows morning guys so it's the last day of vlogmas 2 i'm just about to get my nails done i left you very abruptly yesterday i just showed you a before but this is the after of my brows they're literally just using a clear gel so i am so happy with them they look so good but i'm up early i'm currently sitting outside beth's house to go and get my nails done i'm thinking to get a like um nude nails with like a sparkly tip ombre um so i'll show you that after but yeah no it's still got quite a boring day for vlogging ahead that's why i kind of wanted to do kind of like within a couple of days because um it's just me who edits and vlogs and works um i do have management team obviously with work but um i have to do all the editing and stuff like that so um it kind of takes up a lot of my day so i hope you enjoy this vlog i'll probably do a little bit of an unboxing with you guys and maybe some more christmas gift ideas um but then yeah vlogmas free will be my birthday weekend which is so exciting so yeah i'll catch you guys in a minute because i'm gonna go get my nails done hello guys i am back home now i just had my nails done how pretty are they they're super focus 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 okay it's not focusing but they are super Christmassy. I decided to get Christmas nails already. Wanted them for my birthday, so yeah, I went for it. Um, yeah, just got home and made myself a coffee. Um, I'm just gonna go and hang out my bedding because that's just been washed. Um, yeah, I'm going to do, do a bit of a home on unboxing for you and kind of chat through some stuff that I have so far got for the house. Right, first off, it is super cold in my house. We have quite an old house and I didn't realise actually how cold it gets. I'm just going to go and put my scarf away. Um, but yeah, I thought I'd quickly show you the final result of my, um, under my bed. I'm so happy with those boxes. I'll leave those boxes down below for anyone who has an Ottoman bed. Um... They were quite like the perfect like deepness. So yeah, so this is what it is looking like at the moment. Um, so in here is like all my beauty products. These are the things like I like to keep, um, things that I'm wanting to try out and stuff like that, but it'll also be like a PR box as well. Um, bags and scarves. Over there is just some PR clothing I've received. This box is a bit of a decoration box. I've just been given loads of tissues but it's got champagne glasses in there which will be removed and just like really pretty vases and everything like that so really cute decoration bits and then here is like bags and um, cosmetic bags knitted jumpers um and like all my sweatshirts and stuff like that which clog up so much of my wardrobe um so yeah that's really handy to keep it here um these are i need to put these these will go in the attic more like dining room decoration stuff which I love kind of got from NARS and then all of this at the back is like all my textile stuff um which will be staying with my parents so yeah so now I'm in the top of the house which is Oliver's room it's kind of like our storage area as well so <laughs> explains all the boxes behind me um so first off I wanted to share with you is 
it's really silly but i actually got these um wine boxes i was looking at wooden boxes for like storage in the bathrooms in the kitchen in my bedroom and i was really wanting to look for wooden boxes um and then but they were like 20 quid a box and i was like that's so expensive and kind of like i was gonna go and do it but then i was like surely there's a cheaper way and then my um dad was actually ordered a wooden box of wines so and my granddad orders loads of boxes of wines as well so i was like could you keep them because they make really perfect boxes they're free technically to me um and yeah i get another use out of them really lovely boxes and i feel like the having the wine box like names on them gives a bit of character as well so that was really handy they're quite big as well um so yeah so i have currently two at the moment and then hopefully i'll get some more from my granddad excuse my brother's batman in the background um next up next up i got a smeg machine um i will leave a picture actually because i don't actually want to get it out until i get to the new place and i'll probably talk to you guys about that then um so i got a white smeg coffee machine i just love the look of it i don't really want pods um so that was one of my things as well i was looking at the sage coffee machines but it did work out cheaper to get the smeg one um and i just like the aesthetics of it and i tried it out in bath when i went with my family and it was really good um it's one of those things coffee machines it's like it's really hard to kind of decide if it's really good or not on the first go because we only used it a couple of times so it was really hard to like but like i think we've got a duolingo downstairs and i found that quite hard at the beginning but now i'm like obsessed with it so i'm hoping that i will get the same with that and we got it in discount at selfridges it had 10 percent off um so it came to a lot cheaper i think it came to 280 i think it was so that was really good as well maybe even cheaper actually i feel like it might have been even cheaper than that um so yeah so i got that and i got it in white and i'll leave a picture here and it's just gonna look beautiful next up i got this ironing board from wilkinson's and i really like the print on it and it's not a massive one it's quite a small one so that'll be quite good for storage you don't really want a massive one in our place as much as it is big um yeah you just want to kind of put it away and this will fit perfectly in our bathroom cupboards so that will be really nice i'll do a proper like unfurnished like house tour when i get the keys on the 18th so that's really exciting so that will be probably in one of the last vlogmas that's mad for one of my birthday presents because it's my birthday this weekend my mum was like oh like what would you like and i was actually being a bit more um wise with my present choices because i was like i'm moving out i'm gonna need all these things so we actually luckily my birthday kind of falls around black friday and all the sales so it was really incredible sales so it was with dusk.com and we had the biggest sale it was 65 um percent off which was incredible um and we got so many amazing things first up we got these pillows so it comes with the pillowcases as well these are the vienna cushion covers 50 by 50 and they're just like a really nice i don't know if this light's going to show it looks quite blue um but it's like a really nice like i want to say like a champagne -y gold color champagne -y, like really clean color it is beautiful so i got two of those a matching fro i'm just gonna say how much all of this cost now because it's ridiculous how much it costs it costs 180 pounds for two pillows and cushions fro whole bed set four towels hand towels floor mat and usually like in white company they cost like 300 pounds for just the fro so we got an insane deal and they really look like white company we got the 100 by 150 in the light gray i will leave all these down below as well so i got four of those like just in case like, I have guests over um, when we can. So yeah, so that was that as well. So I got four, like just spares, like if the others are in the wash. Hand towels. I won't show you everything, but I got the Portofino 200 cotton per kale waffle duvet set. And it's like this really nice, um, like embossed, kind of like that like, kind of dips in. But this is the best. I love these fabrics. My bedding is drying literally just here and it is that like kind of waffly fabric. I love, I think it's the nicest fabric. Um, I just find it so cozy and also you don't have to iron it. I mean, you can if you want to, um, but because it's that kind of like waffle, 
it hides the, the, the creases. You're welcome. Next up, my lovely friend Millie has a gorgeous like interior accessory shop called Maram. I'm going to leave all the products that I feature down below. Um, so I got this basket firstly. Um, I just love it. I think it's really cute. And it'd be really nice to put like blankets in there. Um, like picnic blanket. It could actually be good like if I'm transporting my laptop and things like that. But it just looks really pretty and I think that'll look really lovely in the lounge with like blankets overflowing it. So I thought that was a really nice little accessory. Then from Wilkinson's, I got these vases. These, um, I don't know what they're called. I'm really sorry. Um, modern square glass lanterns. And they were £5 each from Wilkinson's and I just thought they looked really nice. And you couldn't tell they're from Wilkinson's or £5. And then I'm just going to put a little candle in them. So I got two of those. Another thing from Wilco, I got a serving chopping board. It was like £3, so it's really good. So I just thought I might as well start. I'm not going to go crazy. I won't go crazy, but you know. And then I think this is the last thing I actually got. So I'm really proud of myself. It's currently got all the um, protection and stuff in it. But this is from Maram as well. It's this really gorgeous green vase, which I think is absolutely stunning. The large green glass vase from HK. It's £29.99. Yeah, I just love that. I think that'll look really nice on the kitchen island. We have a beautiful kitchen island, which is just going to be stunning. Flowers and candles. So yeah, really happy with that. So yeah, just like slowly stocking up. So yeah, that's it so far. I have ordered a kettle, so I need to figure out where that is. Really pretty as well. So I will show you pretty much everything. If it looks a bit weird in this kind of setup, it's gonna, um, it's all like in storage. But I move out on the 28th and I am going to vlog it. Um, I'm going to probably do a weekly vlog from now on, which is really exciting. And it's something that I really enjoy watching. Like they are my favorite vlogs, um, just like personal preference. So I wanna create them as well. So I hope you enjoy them. And I feel like I have a bit more to share with you because I'll be sharing my interior and a bit more of a lifestyle just because where I live with my parents I find it sometimes hard to vlog because obviously like it's their place they won't want to be on camera kind of thing um so yeah so I'm really excited to have my own little place with my best friend I'm so excited so I cannot wait to show you that but yeah I think I'm going to leave this vlog here because I think it's quite long and then I am going to pick my camera straight up because it is my birthday weekend. So tonight me and mum are decorating the dining room. Just It's just going to be us. We just wanted to um, make it special, you know. My birthday is actually on the Sunday but we're going to like have a fancy dinner on the Saturday because mum and dad are at work. Yeah, we're going to do paella, champagne um, and cake. So really lovely and we're decorating for Christmas anyway so I guess it's kind of like like a, a trial to see how pretty we can make it for Christmas. Um, so yeah, tonight we're gonna decorate it. So I'll show you bits of that. And yeah, I'm really excited. So yeah, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed Vlogmas too. I will catch you guys next time. Everything will be linked down below. I'll see you in the next vlog.